Hi friends, welcome to Let's Learn YouTube channel. Mainframe interview questions. Friends, recently I have encountered an interview question, which is basically how to find out when the program is compiled. So basically the interviewer was asking, uh, how do we get the time of when the program is compiled? I mean time and date, date and time basically. Okay. So in order to achieve this, there are two ways to find out the compiled time of a given program. Okay. So first way is basically we can use a yeah, COBOL internal function when compiled. Okay. This is first way. And second way is basically we can use, uh, we can see basically the compilation time in basically the load library. Okay. The other way is to see the compilation time in load library. Okay. These are the basic two ways. Coming to the first way. To achieve the first way, I mean by using COBOL internal function when compiled, how we, we should code that. Okay. If you look at this program, I am simply given identification division, environmental division, and working storage where working storage section. In working storage section, I haven't used any variable. Okay. Directly I came to procedure division and in procedure division, I have just coded display compile time. Okay, function when compiled. Okay, this is the important point for us. Basically, function when compiled, what does this do is, basically it will give the compilation time of that given program. Okay, for this program, whenever this program is compiled, that time will be stored in when compiled function basically. So whenever we use when compiled, we should compulsory use function. In front of it, we should use function. We are not declaring this when compiled variable in data division working storage section we are not going to declare because this is internal to COBOL it is a internal function okay after internal function when we are whenever we are using internal function we should code function in front of it so if you look at here display compile time function when compiled have given simple statement okay nothing else we should give no working storage variables we should declare okay after this i just coded stop run so this is the basic program so this program what does this show it will display basically when this program is compiled so how it is achieving it is just using when compiled function with that function we are able to display when this program is compiled okay so this is the program friends what i am doing is i am just saving this uh, compiling this program okay let me compile this program okay let me go out and compile this program let's copy the program name okay i have copied the program name so let's go to compilation jcl and submit this model okay compile this model okay so i'm just changing the program name to compile and if you see here in compile jcl i am using load library here and the load library is each dot cobol dot load lib okay remember this library okay i am just submitting this jcl okay i am submitting means basically i am compiling this program okay i have com compiled this program i have submitted it okay now let's go and see if we got max is zero zero because we haven't used any variable uh, when compiled and we got max is zero so this says that there is no necessity of using when compiled variable in working storage section okay this is clear right now let's go and see execute this program okay let's go and execute the program okay so i am executing just executing the program okay and let me submit this just here okay here also we got max is zero and the job id is 2100 okay let's go to spool and see whether we got when compiled time or not okay i am going to 3.4 before going to 3.4 i just want to show the mainframe time okay tso time i have given tso time will display the mainframe server time if you see here it is 4 42 50 pm and october 25th 2023 okay this is the time remember this 4 42 okay october 25th okay this is the time now i am going to basically spool to find out whether we got the required output or not okay if you remember, this is the job ID I have mentioned. Let's go to this job ID and see in the sysout whether we got compilation time or not. Okay. If you look at here, we got compilation time. What time we have seen? 441, right? 441. If you look at here, 441, 2023, 10. This is October 25th. 16 means four, it is 4. 41 okay we got 441 october 25th this is the time when this program is compiled okay now this is one way we have seen friends at any point in this video if you feel this video is helpful please like the video friends it will help me to make more videos with respect to interview questions
the second way is basically we should go for the load library okay the second way is to go for the load library this is the load library okay this is what the load library let's go to the load library okay i'm going to the load library if you look at here this is the basic load library which we used in compile this year and we had we have our program here okay let's go to this program and try to find out date okay today the century is 2023 right so i am giving just 2023 finding out the 2023 century okay here i am trying to find if you see here you can see that basically when the program is compiled 2023 1025 16 means 441 so whatever we got here it is same displayed in the spool also same thing will be displayed in the spool also let's go and see in the spool whether we got the same output or not okay let's go and see in the spool whether we got same output or not 2023 this is what we got here let let me copy this here and see whether we got same thing or not okay it is not copying there because we are in browse mode a view mode if you look at here 2023 10 25 64 okay this is what 16 41 okay 10 2023 10 25 16 41 2023 10 25 60 41 so we can see the basic compilation time in two ways one is through program when compiled option when compiled function and also in the load library also we will be able to find the compilation time that's it friends i'm done with this question friends at any point in this video if you feel this video is helpful please like the video friends also please like share and subscribe the channel friends thank you friends have a nice day